This is mile zero of the Trans-Canada Highway in St. John's, Newfoundland. Can you do that? Can you have mile zero of a highway on an island? And St. John's is actually where Canada and all of North America begins its day, where the first lights of day hit at Cape Spear off St. John's Harbor. It's actually the oldest city on the continent. The first tourism crews across the Atlantic actually came to Newfoundland 500 years ago. They wanted to see the rugged coastlines, and it's the rare city to have an apostrophe in its name. One thing I won't forget is Hurricane Maria, who blew through here during my visit and made my flag seem a bit challenging. Before 1949, Newfoundland was its own republic, not part of Canada, and it had its own flag with pink. And now this is the Newfoundland flag. Come on, look at that. This is great. This is a great, this is horrible out. What are we doing outside? We could be doing this inside. And inside we go for a Newfoundland favorite, fish and chips. St. John's best fish and chips. I needed that. Water Street is the oldest street on the continent and it's got random people stopping you in the middle of a hurricane. We love people from away. Yeah. And they're always That's welcome here. To me, this isn't a city. To me, it's a town. And everybody knows everybody, and everybody's friendly. There you go. Revolutionized. <laughs> Aside from the people of St. John's, I'll remember the hills. This is the Hill of Chips. The place, actually, where the British Empire began, when Sir Humphrey Gilbert came here and proclaimed all of Newfoundland for the Queen. Locals and visitors alike enjoy walking the Signal Hill Trail at the edge of St. John's Harbor. I follow the path that runs along the Battery neighborhood, out along the coast, up the steps, all the way up to Cabot Tower, built to commemorate the 400th anniversary of John Cabot's landfall in St. John's. A highlight of my St. John's experience was a day trip to the town of Heart's Desire, where I attended a Newfoundland kitchen party. Here's a travel rule. Anytime you see a bar with a sign that says stories, beers, and wood-burning stoves, you go in. I'll give you the best souvenir that you'd ever get in Newfoundland, huh? Watch. What's that? <laughs> That's a kiss off a Newfoundland woman. Thank you. That is that. <laughs> I got it. 